Hello there guys, it's me Wisely and welcome to a new episode of Healthy Gods Max Build together with my Hybrid Magic uh, <laughs> Hybrid Magus Exorcist Build So last time we have a uh, uh, Two hybrid uh, Hybrid Crusader and hybrid uh, Archer with a uh, Two types of uh, skill set or skills uh, set builds so we have uh, our uh, hybrid force so we have uh, our main stats strength 150 vitality 90 dexterity 40 and spirituality 144 we have 1935 defense 1455 hp 75% fire resistance 75% Ice resistance, 75% lightning resistance, and 75% poison recovery. So on our cast attack attributes, we have 664 force per second. That has 1.78 attacks per second. Attack rating for uh, 435 force per hit, 374 critical chance, 5%. Critical damage 100%, stun chance 0%, knockback chance 16%. So on miscellaneous attributes, we have 4.6 walk speed, 75 life regeneration per second, 0 0.6 second hit recovery, reduce cooldown 50%, identify cooldown 60 seconds, trader price reduction 0%, magic find well uh, 122%. The gold find 40%. So on uh, melee damage reflection 150%. Range damage reflection 150%. Melee damage reduction 5%. Range damage reduction 5%. Melee defense reduction 0%. Range defense reduction 0%. Melee attack rating reduction 35%. And range. Attack rating reduction 35%. So on our equipments, we have Dictum Ignis. Uh, yeah, Dictum Ignis. We also have Durin's Ban, Skadi, Use Libare, Kite Shield with a 150% uh, melee damage reflection and 150% uh, range damage reflection and 70% uh, lightning resistance so we have also skimil presidium marot de chatillon stave bow with uh, 36% cooldown reduction or faster cooldowns and 60 life regeneration per second we also have drop mirrors and tasilo chalice so that's it we have our uh, equipment but we also have this one uh, our first skill set uh, first skill set the skill set a the canon build so why this uh, why it's called the canon because of blizzard turi ball and fireball and most of them are two uh, two second cooldown which means you can use them as a cannon nice so we have loaded sparks our main attack 13 over 24 and its booster overload 13 over 18 we also have blizzard our first cannon 30 over 30 secondary cannon to ball 13 over 24 in its booster purification 16 over 18 the last uh, cannon fireball 13 over 24 in its booster hot plate 13 over 18 and last uh, booster eruption 24 over 24 we also have cadaverin and we also have our passives as well such as fire mastery 13 over 18 ice mastery 13 over 18 and lightning mastery 13 over 18 so we are we're going to reset our skill builds to have our uh, to have our uh, skill set B. So. 
So we're going to start off with this one. Nice. Lightning. Okay. And that's it. We have our sick skill set B, our second skill set for this hybrid uh, force build. So we have loaded sparks, 24 over 24, and its booster overload, 13 over 18. So I uh, I upgrade the booster on a one skill point because of the additional sparks. That's uh that's my that's the only benefit of this uh, uh of this booster instead of, uh other than uh, additional lightning damage. So we also have Calaverine 24 over 24 and blessed pounds 13 over 30 and four shield 30 over 30 and its booster amber 13 over 18 another booster agate 13 over 18 Another booster score 13 over 18 and last booster vengeance 13 over 24 so why uh, loaded sparks instead of other abilities so I have loaded sparks because all of uh, almost all of monsters have uh, doesn't have a lightning resistance instead the lightning uh, the creep crawler and creep hunter are the only monster that has a lightning resistance but we have our load a uh, force shield and with vengeance that reflects damage because uh, creep crawler and creep hunter doesn't deal lightning damage but phys physical damage so that's why we have reflect dam uh, for shield up to vengeance, and we also have uh, damage reflection by one hundred fifty percent melee and range. So that's it. We have our skill set A and skill set B. So the hybrid force complete, and yeah, we'll see how it goes on the next video and that's it for today's video thank you guys so much for watching heretic gods monday wednesday friday and sunday so make sure to subscribe ideas and suggestions let me know in the comments and we'll see you guys on the next video and have a good day